Hey guys, Flying Ross here, welcome back to the channel, and today I'm discussing City Skylines traffic. And this is a traffic tip. Now I found this on the forums, and it's really kind of easy to see here, but on the left hand side, we see a six lane one way road with two lane roads uh, coming off of it, but there are two lanes going either direction. And what happens is that their AI does not like to use that middle section. Now there's this trick that someone found on the forums where if you use a one way street after every intersection, what it does is it actually forces the AI to make a choice with which lane it wants. So the AI traffic will actually move into the lane that it wants to be into for its next move, which actually makes traffic flow a lot smoother. Also with this idea is there's no red lights, there's no stop signs because you're constantly see using one ways. As you can see that it's always a one way branching off from the six way and there's nothing ever coming in. So that means that there's no traffic. So let's see if we can show this to you in game and see what you think. Okay, so now that we see, saw that little diagram, now we can actually f find or see this pinch in action. So let's uh, go down in here and this is a side part of the city I just built. And we can see that right here we have sort of six lane uh, roads and then we go down to the two lanes but one way and then one way branching off as well. So this does not create any traffic signals here or any stop signs so it's really good for traffic flow. And as you can see there uh, we travel down now I do have a stoplight here because this is a six a meeting six. I designed it and then I redesigned it and yeah so I could put I think a single lane in here or one way I don't necessarily know if it would help. But some red lights is okay. And you can see my buses are freaking this load full of people. Um, but as we travel down this road, we can see that our bridge is coming in into view. And we have a lot of traffic actually coming. And they're using a whole bunch of different lanes, which is what we want. And this we can see really well here that this pinch is forcing the AI to actually choose a different lane. So and when they get to the next intersection the traffic is spread apart at a greater difference and then also it's not backed up as much so even though there's a red light here again another pinch it's making cars choose which lanes to use and it really does help now i don't have any pinches here because i mean i mean you can do it every single one i don't know if you need to do it every single one um because a lot of my blocks are pretty close together but you can see even here that this is good because it's using this right lane and it's like a hey, right lane yeah you're going off the highway so this second lane they're using for oh yeah he can still turn there but when there's a lot of traffic you see that guy he chose over there is uh, on the far side so that's pretty pretty darn good so and then even this pinch right here oops sorry i know you guys complained about the camera angle but this pinch right here is still forcing them to decide which one of these lanes that he want they want to use so even though this is a very long road, it still comes down to another pinch, and then it's this is coming on. Again, no traffic signals. Now we do have a traffic signal there, but have a, you know minimizing those amount of traffic signals um, is you know what we're aiming for. I mean, even here we have the highway coming in uh, out on um, two different ways, and we're making a left hand turn. No signal at all. And it's look at that. Our buses are choosing different lanes. Our cars are choosing different lanes, and that's what we kind of. That's really what we want to see. We want to see them use multiple different lanes. And even though there's a signal there because my trash trucks are over there, it definitely helps out. So that's the pinch, and I hope that it helps you guys out. You know, I hope that it helps you traffic. And I just want to show you like traffic, like you know, even though this is a really bad traffic jam, this used to be far worse. And this pinch is helping because it's making them choose. So yes, even though it's this far back and it's coming onto my one way here, and this is, is a very large one way circle, at least it's actually forcing them to go in. And I think I just have too many buses right now. So that will end this video. Next video I will be doing is on mass transit, buses and subways. So I hope this new pinch method did help you out in some way. If you did like the content and you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. It does mean a lot to me. Um, as always, please leave a comment below. I do read them all and I do try to answer them all. So until next time, I'll check you guys later.